All right, so hello everyone. Today we'll be having Torchy's Tacos. It's an Austin chain here, and we we are going to try a little bit of each taco. And if you know, you know, this queso is what everyone raves about. It's super good. Super good. You have to have it. It's like, it's so good. All right, so first things first, we're gonna have the um, chips. It's very nice. It's crisp, not too oily. I'm gonna get some of the queso. All right. Mmm. The queso is really good because it's spicy, creamy, cheesy, and it doesn't feel overwhelming. It's balanced. There's avocado in there as well. There's a lot of flavors. It's not a bland cheese, okay? They put a lot of flavors in there. All right, now we're gonna start with the tacos. We're gonna start with um, Trashy Trailer Park. And in this taco, it's chicken, cheese, looks like some kind of sauce, cheese sauce maybe. This looks like a flour tortilla. I'm just gonna take a little because there's a lot of tacos today to try. All right, and that's my cut. Mmm. So this one. Oh! Oh! Mmm. Mm. So this one kind of has that Cajun-y flavor. So it's like, it's not regular, just like deep fried chicken tenders. I don't know if you can see it, but there's some Cajun seasoning in it. And I think that's cheese. Yeah, it's really good. It, I wouldn't say it's a traditional taco, but it's pretty good. It's up there. Okay, so this was the trailer park. I'm gonna leave it in the wrapper so I know which one it was. I'm gonna just line it up back here. The next one we're gonna try is the crossroads. All right, this looks good. So if you can see the beef here, there's an avocado. Looks like it's, um, what is that? That's cheese. The Crossroads is a brisket taco, okay? There's some cheese here, avocado, brisket shredded up, and then there's some jalapenos here. And that white stuff is cheese, okay? Take a little bite of this. I'm gonna spread out the jalapenos. I'm gonna add a little bit of this pico de gallo. Let's have a small bite of everything. Mmm. It's good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So, yeah, it tastes like brisket. Um, I kind of, cow, <laughs> my cats are interested in the video. Cow niraga. Yeah, my cats, they love cheese. So they're smelling that cheese and they're wanting some. I'm gonna open my Coke Zero. So the brisket, the, um, what was it, trailer? No, it wasn't trailer part. The Crossroads um, taco was pretty good. It kind of had that, um, I don't know if you guys had like oxtail soup and there's some kind of um, meat in there. It kind of tasted like that. It was soft, 
It was good. It was good. I liked it. So, moving on. We're gonna try another taco. I'm gonna just leave it like this so you guys can see what we've had so far. Now we're gonna try the Democrat. Okay. Ooh, and it comes with a little lime. Mmm, this must be the barbacoa. So this is barbacoa. If you see here, it's a little bit more moist, uh, more juicy looking than the Crossroads brisket. And then there's some kind of cheese here, avocado, and then they looks like cilantro, and some maybe spring onion in there. All right. I'm just gonna get a small bite. I'm making sure I have a little bit of everything in this bite. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If you're coming to <clears throat> if you're coming to Austin and you want the taco experience, you need to get this Democrat taco. This is, this is really good. Yeah, it's really good. I like it a lot. And they give you a little courtesy lime, just in case it's a little bit too meaty for you. All right, so next it's the bush fire. And it looks like it has Diablo sauce. Okay. So this looks like, um, that looks like mango. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is called the bush fire. There's mango, some sort of chicken, I think. I think it's chicken. Yeah, and some chicken, sour cream, cilantro. This looks interesting. I've never had this before, so I'm kind of intrigued. All right, so I'm just gonna get a small bite. So I'm making sure I have a bite of everything. Just gonna go ahead and try it. Mmm. Mm-hmm. This is really good. It's spicy. Tangy. And the mango, I believe it's to be, it's cooked somehow because it's very fall apart-ish. It's cooked or canned. Mm, it's good. I like it. It's tropical-y. Not overwhelming, it's good. It might be my new favorite, oh my gosh. So that was the bush fire. It was really good. Okay, and last but not least, the Baja Shrimp Grilled, okay? This is one of my favorites and it has a courtesy line, which I like, because some people, they like to have that, that little hint of lime with their tacos. And this taco, if you look here, it has onions, let me, pickled onions, carrots, it looks like cabbage, shrimp, some form of cheese, they have cilantro, okay, and then the shrimp. Let me show you. I like the grilled shrimp more than the fried one. But that's just my, that's just my personal preference. So I'm gonna cut up a small piece. Okay. And this shrimp, you actually need to eat it with this sauce right here. Okay. If you like that extra cream, that creamy ranch kind of flavor, then you eat it with the sauce. If not, if you just like your sh taco, shrimp taco straight up, then just have it straight up. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and eat it. 
Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So normally, normally I order the shrimp taco and it's my favorite. I eat it all the time. It's my favorite, favorite, favorite. But you know what? I might have a new favorite. Oh my gosh. Let me tell you. Top three tacos for today. The big players, okay? Barbacoa, all right? Number one, if you come to Austin and you wanna try it and have the full taco experience, you need to try the barbacoa. Barbacoa is actually, I think it's the tongue or like some, for, some form of the head of the cow, okay? It's really soft, really tender. Second, today, it's gonna be the bush fire, the chicken and the mango. Oh my gosh, the chicken and the mango was so good. All right. And the third, which, which was my favorite up until I had the bush fire, is gonna be the shrimp, the grilled shrimp tacos, okay? And if you're coming to Austin and you want the tacos, please get do yourself a favor and get the queso. It is so good. And it's so like creamy and spicy. I thought I wouldn't like the queso. I love it. Mm. Mm. Queso is key. All right, and also please have it with some salsa. This salsa, let me... This green salsa is not that spicy, but it's kind of peppery in my opinion. It's kind of peppery and kind of tangy. So if you like tangy salsa, get this one. If not, go with the Rojas, the red salsa, okay? And if you like the creaminess with your shrimp tacos, please have it with the sauce. If not, avoid it. All right, thanks for joining me today and I'm gonna finish up eating. And if you come to Austin, please try the barbacoa um, and then the bush fire and then um, the grilled shrimp tacos. But for me, I'm biased. I personally like shrimp a lot. So that's why, you know, in my top, there's always gonna be shrimp tacos. All right, if you come to Austin, please hit up Torchy's Tacos and I hope you, um, Learn something from this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. The tomatillo, 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 or tomatillo. I don't know. I can't. I can't read. Apparently, I don't know. Oh, sorry. That's not tomatillo. That's called the Democrat. Shoot. Don't kill me. Brush fire. I would.